Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing Never give up, never slow, till I finally prove it Never listen to the no's, I just wanna keep moving Keep my head up when I act, head up, that's a fact There's a familiar little face. Hello. Hello. It's been a while. Do it again, and we'll do it the pants. Salon Selectives! Like you just out of a salon. <laughs> that, You're going to put that, that in super that slow. That just went super slow. Right. Check this out. Lots of candid cameras. So the reason, <laughs> the reason why we have three cameras on us at the moment is because they say the camera adds 10 pounds. So <laughs> we're trying to look massive. Hopefully we <laughs> There was, there was a worrying moment a couple of minutes ago when we rocked up wearing the same jumper, but we've both taken it off. It's all right, yeah. We, we manned it out. So, why are we here? Well, Sean, in Sean Stiley, is starting a podcast and he isn't doing it by halves. So, we're here, filming, recording, we're in Shoreditch. I rode down on the bike, which I thought was a really clever little plan. So I was like, ah, I'm on the bike, I'll be super fast. Nope, it took me an hour longer than it would have done in the car, because I went the wiggly way. Yeah, we were supposed to do an altitude training session in City Athletic, but he missed that because he was in traffic. Yeah, so, but on a, on a silver lining bed of cloud, now Sean and I are going to do a dual training session at another time um, using like no altitude trainer. Yeah, so yeah. we'll get like our baseline, then we'll go into the altitude room, push ourselves in there and see like how it feels, difference it makes and, and going on. Well, maybe, maybe do like a Cooper's run. So we'll do like a, as far as you can run in 12 minutes on a treadmill. And then we do that at sea level, and then we can go and see how not far we can run doing it at altitude. Can you crawl at any point during that? <laughs> <laughs> well, you can start, you can go as fast as you like. So. And then hopefully over the time, both uh, Sean and I will crack on and do some more of that kind of fundamental, foundational, functional training, because you ran up a mountain. Little run. Actually, I just forgot about that. That's really unfair. You ran up a mountain. I ran up a little mountain. I get tired of running up the drive. Right, we're going to go podcast. We're going to go podcast. <laughs> yeah, come on. Let's see podcast. you in a bit. Bye-bye. It's been a while, it's been a while Lexus you two, how are we doing? It's been a little while. It has, since September I believe was the last time we were together on okay. camera. See? You missed me? We've missed him. Missed last time we saw each other I was dancing in my pants. You were. We've cut back to that scene now. So, we've just finished a productive week at Gymshark and I've took Lexus camera just to find out what he's like behind the scenes. So we've got some of the guys here and let's find out. Guys, what have you thought about Lex this week? Yeah, it's been good man. Professional, cool guy, pretty much how he is sort of like in general, like online, like how you'd think he'd be, like not weird or nothing. Yeah, he's quite easy to film. I mean, he got like most of his takes first go. Pretty, pretty professional. You can tell he's obviously a professional athlete. Takes his like, stuff yeah, very like, seriously. He's done it before, yeah. like he's done stuff like this before, it's good. Yeah, takes it super, super seriously. He's really like one of the easiest people I've ever had to work with, not gonna lie. Just yeah. too good. Very, professional. very modest about his physique. <laughs> and we're back. Yes, that's that's what Sam has to put up with on a, de a daily basis. It's all my ideas. <laughs> Always trying to get me stripped down. But we are back in the gym with possibly the world's greatest lighting, Flex Fitness in Birmingham. And we're here today shooting for Gymshark. We've already done the morning shoot. That's all the stills and pictures. I'll put a couple of those up now. And that was with my man. Wait a minute, where is he? Yo. This man. Tom, do you remember Tom? <clears throat> do you remember Tom from another video? Again, for some reason, I ended up in my pants. So I'll show you that again now. Yo, yo. This is really weird. I'm never really on video. Uh, so yeah, this is the third or fourth time I've shot with Lex now, Gymshark. Um, and yeah, we, we rock it pretty well these days. It's been pretty good today in Leeds. We've got this amazing old gym. And yeah, this is generally what it's like to shoot with Lex. The pants dance. Professional. The, the the most professional person I've ever shot with. Yeah. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs>
Dance for me. Conor McGregor wins. Yeah, yeah, this is it. And uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> Whoa, and we're NDA, back. NDA, NDA. <laughs> so those images are by Tom. We're now going to run through the afternoon. It's going to be video shoots. These are lovely ladies <laughs> that have been feeling me up inappropriately all day. So Nipples. many sexual harassment oh, cases yeah, are going through. I just stack them up and at the end of the day I just launch endless amounts of sexual harassment touching going on. It's ridiculous. It. ridiculous. I'm so sorry. You're not sorry at all. No. Not, not, not even slightly sorry. The rest of the day we're doing uh, like a full workout. I'm just going to go get stuck in. They're going to be filming. It's going to go up on Gymshark Train. Uh, the images and that will be on main Gymshark. And this is for releases of the new Legacy range. So we're talking about those old school looks, looks, the old school this. It's coming back, and it's coming back in a big, big way. Huh. Okay, so we've just finished doing some really cool shit with the boxing. I have a serious sweat on, check this out. A little bit of a preview. <laughs> Sneaky elbow, it's supposed to just be boxing. I'll see you later. Whoa. And as cool as that is, it generated quite sweat. And now you're about to see what it's like to get off one of these when you're very sweaty. Tom. Yeah. Take control of the sweat cam. I'm on it. Sweat cam. Okay, ladies, you're about to see something very special. This is awesome. You're about to be. This is my seductive hoodie removal dance. <laughs> the music's there. <laughs> Go on, mate. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> And for my next trick, <laughs> no. that's not exaggeration. <laughs> that is it. It is a wrap. And I can honestly say, today's shoot was one of the rawest we've done. And I'm absolutely gazeboed. The whole of my body is just in pain. But this is my type of things and my type of shoot where it's raw, it's energetic. I just get to train, smash things in, get a little bit dirty, get a little bit nasty. And we end up with some really, really awesome shots you'll see over the next few weeks with the launch of the new Legacy Lines. It's all coming back, that old school Lex in Lux. Lex in smash Lux. it out again. Thank you for this, man. We hopefully we'll see more of this guy's face. Yeah, yeah, for We'll sure, see you man. soon. For, Definitely, man. Although, he's a little bit mean. He makes you lift a lot of weights a lot of times. Hey man, just making you look good, that's all it <laughs> is. making me look good. Yeah. That's it, I'll catch you wherever the hell I'm at next. Peace. So there you have it, a little insight into me on shoot days and my work environment. And I know it's a bit of a silly video, a bit of a fun one, but I just wanted to get out there the kind of, the way I vibe about things when I go out. When I go out and see people, meet people, do things, go on jobs, even if they're in a professional environment, I go to have fun. I'm gregarious, I speak a lot, I talk to people I don't know, I make an effort with everyone there and I make everyone feel welcome and not make it too kind of, not professional, that's the wrong word because obviously I always act professionally but not too clinical. So a lot of times when you can go on to sets and shoots or to job interviews or to jobs or workplaces, whatever it may be that's relevant to you, a lot of people can go in there with a very professional attitude but almost overly cold or a little bit distant. Make an effort, open yourself up, show your personality. You will be shocked at how that opens other people up around you. And it's that ripple effect. Just you make that, you break through that little bit of a barrier. You break that glass. You, you just shatter that little bit of quiet in the room in a lift. I do it all the time. And you'll be shocked at how other people open up to you and talk back. And it just makes life a little bit more fucking fun. So this is the end of this video. Thank you for watching. If you got this far, hit that like button for me and give me a boom baby in the comments section so I know which ones of you guys to thank. New series is coming in a matter of days. We're kicking it off. We're aiming for December the 3rd. Trailer's just been produced now. Hopefully it'll be ready in time. I want to kick it off there to run you through into the Christmas season. Keep you fired up. Enjoy Christmas. Eat good food. Spend time with family. Drink. Be merry. Have fun. But we can stay on track whilst doing all that. And this whole new series is going to be about showing you how I'm going to be going from I'm going to rhyme it off with cage to stage. But what it's actually going to be is I'm going to be aiming to do a boxing fight boxing match, boxing charity event, and then I'm gonna aim in the middle, of somewhere around all this to also do kind of like a Tough Mudder challenge run marathon style thing, and then finish it all off with 
jumping on stage at the end in probably what's going to be a physique show. And the whole point is to show you guys that you can go and do something functional, something hard, something that is really going to test you and build your level of skill or skill set towards something while still enjoying the gym, while still creating that body and that aesthetic appeal that you like, that is still worthy of a stage. And I wanna show you that that's possible and you don't have to just sit inside the four walls of a gym. So get yourselves ready for the new series. New series, old school Lex, rebuilding that savage. And I think what we're gonna call this series, Undisputed. Woo! Lately I've been doing shit different. Cooking like a chef, I've been all up in the kitchen. Had to make a move. Had to make a little distance A lot of people tripping They could never see the vision Fuck that, tell them bounce, bounce, bounce.